Hello everyone, my name is Abhishek and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will talk about the situation of job market in the months of November and December. Whether you are in the United States, any part of Europe or even in India, the things that I talk in this video applies to all of you. This is a very, very important video. If you are looking for the job search, preparing for the interviews, make sure you watch this video till the end. So first of all, a very important thing to note, the months of November and December, you will see a drastic downfall in the number of interview calls. So let's say you have been preparing for interviews and you were giving interviews in the month of October and suddenly you see decrease in the number of interview calls. Let's say you get four to five interview calls in October and you are getting only one or two calls in the months of November or December. You don't have to worry about it. It is not because of your profile. It is not because of your performance in the interviews, but it is because many companies, especially in the US and Europe, they go for hiring freeze. Why? Because from the third week of November, especially third week and fourth week of November, most of the European countries and also the United States, they celebrate Thanksgiving Day. And in the month of December, everybody celebrates Christmas. So usually what people in the United States and Europe do is they go on long vacations. Unlike in India, where we have a lot of festivals, we have periodic holidays, but in US and Europe, they have less number of holidays throughout the year. And at the end of the year, most of the companies go for shutdown. And even people, what they do is they accumulate all the leaves and towards the end of the year, they go for long vacations. Because of these companies who were hiring candidates, they will stop the hiring or they will pause the hiring because people who have to do the interviews, managers who have to select the candidates, even the HR professionals, if they are on PTOs, if they are on leaves, there is no way company can continue with the hiring process. So what they usually do is unless the positions are critical. So if there are mandatory positions that have to be filled or critical positions, there will not be any uh, hiring freeze for those positions. So the interview process will continue for those positions, but any processes or any jobs that can wait, they will be in hiring freeze. So a point to note, if you are getting less number of interview calls, or even if you are not seeing a lot of recruiter actions on your profile, you don't have to worry. It is because of the job market situation in November and December. Now, subscribers in India, they might have this question, but Abhishek, we don't celebrate Thanksgiving Day or we don't celebrate Christmas as much as the Western countries. So why we will see less number of calls in November and December? So the reason is that India has majority of the companies which are service based. So the Indian companies, they mostly get work from the European clients as well as the US clients. So hiring, if it is freezed in US and Europe, automatically the positions will be freezed even in India, any part of the India or other parts of the world. Because you have client interviews and those client interviews cannot be conducted. So even in India, those companies goes for hiring freeze. TCS, Infosys, Wipro, Cognizant, in all of these companies, if you go to the job portals, you will see there will not be any active positions during these months. Even if you see those positions, they will not conduct interviews for those positions as much they conduct in the previous months. If you're talking about product-based companies, yes, product-based companies, they might not see that much impact the Indian product-based companies, you still might see them doing the interviews, but 
the number of product based companies in india are very less when compared to the service based companies so overall in the months of november and december you will see a drastic downfall now the thing is what should we do so if i am preparing for the interviews should i stop preparing this is very important thing that i wanted to talk in this video don't stop preparing during these months this is the time that you can get to prepare if you are a working professional you get a lot of time because the clients go for vacation so you will not have that much work during november and december many companies service based companies they will have less amount of work you will not do any releases during these months especially in december you will not at all do the releases so you have a lot of time to prepare if you are a working professional make the best use of this time and companies don't even bother towards the end of the year if you take long leaves because they are already in shutdown so if you have leaves accumulated take leaves during this time and try to prepare for the interviews if you are a fresher career gap or if you don't have a job then yeah the times are difficult i can understand but don't lose hope try to prepare in the months of november and december there will be less number of calls if you get the calls make them best out of it if you are not getting the calls wait till january because you cannot do anything beyond that the job market you you cannot control it it is something that is out of your hands so make sure you utilize the time you prepare for the interviews and once the hiring freeze will be done in january many companies will open new regs many companies will be aggressive in hiring because they did not hire for the last couple of months now they don't they don't want any delay they want to hire candidates as soon as possible so there will be aggressive hiring in the month of january make sure you prepare for that so this is what i wanted to convey in this video so if you have any questions related to this topic let me know in the comment section i'll be more than happy to help see you all in the next video take care bye bye